So there we go. I'm here at my travel lodge in Leicester Forest East in Leicester. Uh, today I've driven 330 miles. I've averaged 4.8 miles per kilowatt hour and I've got 74 miles left. Now I did fill up at Weatherby, uh, Weatherby Services, uh, the GridServe Super Quick Rapids. And I think I put, a, well I, I know I did, I put about 100 miles in, um, about 20 kilowatts hour, uh, 20 kilowatt hours. As you can hear and see, I am absolutely bushed. I'm really tired. So one of the purposes of this video was to say that I've been driving, sat in this seat with the car on, seven hours and 13 minutes today. Seven hours, 13 minutes, let that sink in. And in seven hours, I've done 330 miles. I stopped with James for about an hour to have some lunch in a beautiful little town somewhere, I can't remember where. Uh, there wasn't any charges there. But had there been a charger at that eatery, I could have plugged in on a fast charger and added the 100 miles in an hour easily. And that would have then meant I wouldn't have had to stop at Weatherby. But it did stop at Weatherby. It's only for like 18, 19, let's say 20 minutes while I stretched my legs because I've been driving for hours. And that gave me 100 miles to get here with 74 miles left. Purpose of this video is I do not need any more range. I don't need a, another EV with a bigger battery. And for those that still say, oh, when your electric vehicles do 600 miles without stopping, I, I can't even begin to explain how tired I am after doing 330 miles. Now, whether it's my age or what, I don't know. But there you go, bit of a sort of minor rant. I'm too tired to have any more of a rant but if you have been, thanks for watching. Um, I could do a video about going back from here, back up to Orkney, taking my daughter and my grandson with me, but it's just boring content. <laughs> I don't think anyone will watch it. So I'm just gonna repeat going back. So I shall leave Leicester perhaps 80% charged. I will aim to stop at perhaps Weatherby again for a quick top up and then drive all the way up to Perth plug in overnight in Perth and from Perth I can get all the way to Scrabster, catch the ferry, get home. So in essence what I'm saying is two stops, one overnight charge and one 20 minute rapid to go from the top of Scotland to the Midlands comfortably and doing motorway speeds is now possible. If I was in a diesel I would not be able to do it any quicker and I'd still feel just as tired. But hey yo, there you go. I've ram rambled on enough. I'm going to get some shut eye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe and all that stuff. And um, see you next time. Thanks.